Side, but he was going to Navy SEAL training. He'd get up in the morning, he'd go uh, run so many miles before he'd meet me and we'd go to work. He'd go swim in the lake so many miles. And uh, he went in, he left off, and he went in there. And uh, I, I don't want to tell a lie, I can't remember if it was nine months, 12 months, so long before he'd ever get to come back out and even talk to anybody or do anything. And he went through all that, and finally he come out. And I said, what did you miss the most about it? Come on, brother. You know what he said? Sing it. Yeah. He, said, I, he said, all that time I was in there, I never heard nobody sing one song. Been raised in church all his life. Been around singing. And that's something to think about, ain't it? Amen. Uh, he said, I just want to hear somebody sing. Somebody sang for the Lord. Yeah. So we heard some good singing yeah. in here tonight. Didn't we? Yeah. Yeah. Heard some good singing. Brother Dale wanted me to let everybody know that he's uh, uh, praying for the meeting tonight. He went home and he's got about a three hour, four hour journey from here. Uh, about a four hour journey from here uh, to get home. And his dad's real bad sick. And uh, But I, I, he told me to just use wisdom about the revival. And I've been praying about the revival. And uh, I feel like we need to go on. Yeah. I do. I feel like we need to go on. And brother, uh, brother Leo went fishing today. His first cast, he caught a bass and fished four more hours and never caught a thing. <laughs> if he can stay out there four hours, surely we can go a few more nights. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. That's, and that's what we're doing, ain't it? Yeah. We're trying to win somebody to the Lord. Yeah. I know your pastors, well, some of y'all are working and trying to uh, get the lost in. I don't want to wear a meeting out, believe me. I don't want to wear a meeting out. Uh, but they've been a good spirit here. They've been a good spirit here. I, I, I'm glad to be a, a part of it. I'm, gra I'm grateful tonight. So uh, we'll, just, we'll just go a few more nights. We'll be back Monday night. And I know y'all just have Tuesday night service. We'll just at least give it out through Tuesday. See what the Lord does. And it ain't going to hurt us. Uh, if it's dinner and 4 o'clock, it ain't going to hurt us. No, uh, it ain't going to hurt nobody. Amen. Get your Bibles tonight. I'm going to preach something tonight I've never preached before. And uh, you ask the Lord to help me. And God would anoint me tonight in the book of Jonah. In the book of Jonah. Uh, chapter number 2. Jonah chapter number 2. And uh, you ask the Lord to help us. Uh, the Lord uh, started dealing with me the other night when Brother Luther testified. Yeah. And uh, I've never, I've heard that testimony so many times. And some of you that wouldn't hear it, uh, Brother Luther testified and said that he had got his test results back. He had 12 spots on the inside of him. And he said when the doctor called him with the results, he said there's all cancers. Every one of them was. And he said, praise the Lord. Yeah. And I got to tell my wife on the way home, I never did hear about Luther taking chemo. I never did hear about Luther. Uh, I didn't. It just, I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. Amen. I never did hear anymore about what happened. And that's been years ago. Uh, so there must be something in it. Now, we've been saved. A lot of us, you've been saved longer than I have. And we, there ought to be some things that we've learned yeah. along the journey. Right. Lord, we ought to, there ought to be some things that we've learned. Yeah. Amen. Along the journey, and uh, after reading this Bible, and after seeking the face of God, uh, I think tonight the Lord has showed us something here in the Scriptures. The Bible said in Jonah chapter number two. Amen. Jonah chapter number two. I ain't gonna preach long tonight. The Bible said then Jonah prayed unto the Lord, his God, out of the fish's belly, and said, I cried by reason of my affliction unto the Lord. And he heard me out of the belly of hell cried I, and thou heardest my voice. Yeah. For thou hast cast me into the deep, in the midst of the seas, and in the floods compassed me about all the billows, and thy waves passed over me. And then I said, I am cast out of thy sight, yet will I look again toward thy holy temple. Yeah. 
Of the waters compassed me about, even to the soul. The depth closed me round about. The weeds oh, were wrapped around my head. I went down to the bottoms of the mountains. The earth uh, with her bars about me forever. Yet thou hast brought up my life from cor corruption. O oh, Lord my God. Amen. When my soul fainted within me, I remembered the Lord. My prayer came in unto thee, into thy holy temple. They that observe blind vanities forsake their own mercy. I want you to listen, listen to verse 9. I will sacrifice unto thee, and with the voice of thanksgiving, I will pay that that I have vowed. Salvation is of the Lord. And the Lord spake unto the fish, and it vomited out Jonah upon the dry land. That's all that we'll read tonight. <laughs> I want to talk a little bit tonight about let's make him vomit again. Amen. Let's make him vomit again. Now, uh, the sister tonight talked about storms. And uh, you can be in a real good revival just like this and get caught up in the uh, spirit and come to church and worship the Lord, throw your hands up. And, amen. But still go home at night and lay your head down at night and be in one of the worst valleys and uh, fight the devil uh, like you never fought him before. Amen. Now that's just the customer. Amen. That's just the way that it is. Now if you don't want a battle, you're in the wrong race. Amen. Because there is a battle, my friend. Uh, Paul said with the enemy fears and without our fighting to work out the sheep among the slaughter and brother all the day long amen here tonight in the word of God I would find this uh, a prophet I'm not going to call him a great man of God because I really don't feel like he was too good of the man of God not based upon his disobedience amen but his actions yeah. uh, brother and his attitude toward yeah. the Ninevites uh, uh, the Bible said that the Lord uh, spoke up to Jonah amen and said arise and go down to Nineveh and brother to cry out to that great city yeah. uh, that God's going to overthrow it uh, amen I hate tonight uh, brother to be dependent on some man uh, oh, to help me to get to the city of God that yeah. uh, the Bible said put not thy trust uh, in a friend or a God uh, they will let you down uh, amen. I don't care who they are uh, brother they sooner or later uh, amen their arms are only go so far uh, amen their strength can only push so far uh, but tonight what the writers say uh, amen when my heart is overwhelmed uh, I leave me to my rock uh, at the time yeah. I'm glad tonight that I've got a rock. Thank you, the Bible said that Jonah stood up here and what God said. I'd rather that he went down and rather paid the fire down. He then got on a boat and went down toward Tarsus. And you Bible readers know exactly what I'm talking about. And the Bible said that he boarded that ship. He met him there and took off. I'm thinking maybe in his mind. He met I'm not going down to Nineveh. And brother, I'll just get away from God. And my friend tonight, if you've got lost people, that's unsaved or backslid on God, there's nowhere that they can run. And that's thank the Almighty God. David of old said, if I took the wings of the morning and flew to the uttermost part of the sea, the Lord is there. He said, if I make up my bed in hell, he said, even there, he said, the Lord is there. I'm glad tonight that I've got a God. I'm ready to trust the Lord. He's present, he's everywhere. And when he jumped me, I thought that he was running from God. I'd rather maybe gain and ground. I'm that free, you can't run from God. Oh. And God's got something for you to right. And you might as well surrender. Right. And God, you just give on in. Right. Because you're fighting a losing battle. Oh. And the Bible said I'm that Jonah got on this ship. Amen. You know the story. Right. God sent a great storm. Yeah. And friend, you might as well expect it. Anytime you disobey God. Yeah. And brother, well, what does God say? Amen. Oh. They sit. 66 books. And brother, God says an awful lot. And you and I as the children of God of the Bible said them. Amen. That was his word. And old man, he said, I'll give them the good of the land. And but he that refuses. Amen. He said the mouth of the sword of the Lord. I shall devour them. And God just looked 
talking to people that are fearing and all things. He's not a God that you can see. I stand in there with a paddle or a stick ready to beat you over the head. I know the Bible said the just shall live by faith. Yeah. Amen. Let me Listen. go on and get into my message. Of the Bible said of the that great sea. Amen. Begin to roar. Amen. A lie. How brother the wind comes so bad. Of the Bible said the miners and then they rolled and they tried to get the ship. And my friend, they was rowing against yeah. God. Yeah. And you can't row against God's will. Amen. And God's got something for you tonight. Amen. Amen. You might as well accept it. Uh -huh. and the will of the Lord. And they rolled with everything they had. And they couldn't get no relief. And they found Jonah. Amen. Laying down there asleep. Ain't that something? Amen. Probably sleeping everything off. And they woke him up. And they said, Oh, sleeper. Amen. What are you doing down here? And the Bible said that Jonah raised up. He knew why. And the story was erected. And because he had been told him, he was running from the presence of God. And the Bible said, Amen. It got so bad that Jonah. Suicide. Yeah. Amen. Yes, that's right. that's right. He did not know. Amen. What God had prepared. Yeah. He was more or less uh, just giving himself away. I'm yeah. to jump overboard. He yeah. said, I tell you what, man, if you throw me overboard, he said the storm will cease. Yeah. And that's exactly what they did. They tried hard. Yeah. But they knew they had a backslid preacher, right. a brother on the boat. Yeah. And they said, You're going to have to throw me overboard. And the Bible said that God had prepared a man of great fish. Oh my. That's so the said, preacher, I don't believe in it. How do you mean you don't believe in it? How can a virgin have a baby? How can a man be dead three days and raise again? later on, I said amen, as Jonah I was in the belly of the whale, he told us in the New Testament of what kind of fish it was, yeah. he said so shall have the son of man, have brother be in the heart of the earth, have yeah. the Bible said when that preacher, amen, jumped overboard, or they threw him out in that boisterous wind, here come that big old fish, opened up that mouth, So 
pray last Sunday. And I said, Lord, I couldn't feel the Lord, Tommy. Amen. I like to thank God and praise Him. Amen. Like Dale preached last night. Amen. When I'm pouring the oil on Him, I like to get blessed while I'm praising Him. And God said, wait a minute, Jason. You mean I've got to pour something on you? Make you cry? And make you feel so high? Ain't that before you bless me? I said, no, sir, Lord. Ain't that I don't want to feel a thing right now. I just begin to praise God. Yeah. Thank you, God, of my mouth. Ain't that the devil? He don't know what to do. Oh, God, all those people, I begin to magnify his name. I'm talking about no singing. I'm talking about no preaching. I'm talking about nobody there with you. I'm just thanking him. I'm for the breath you breathe. I'm thanking him. I'm for saving your soul. I'm thanking him. When I tell you you got cancer, I thank him. I tell you when you lost your children and you lost your family, I thank him. When you got sickness in your body, I thank him. Oh, you say, preacher, you can't do it. It's got to be right. The instruments has got to be right. It's got to be that right song about mother. That right song about dad. Hey Amen. The feeling, the emotion in the air. It's got to come down just right. Help for us to do this. Help for us to raise her. But I've seen where Jonah was in the valley of the way. I said, Lord, I want to have a testimony meeting. I want to thank you right down here in the valley of this way. I said to you right now, hey Amen. The devil's used to your murmuring. He's used to your complaining. He's used to you having your head down. They're walking around like you lost. And your best friend. But if you want to make it get off of your back, if you want to make the devil vomit you out of his hand, open your mouth. Just 
on that girl. And she opened her mouth. And she said, Praise the Lord. Yeah. Amen. Just like that. Yeah. And just a few months later. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Her chest still a hurting her. Here come the ambulance. And they set her on the car. And before I got out of my driveway, I said, Honey, I was in the ambulance with her. Amen. Before I got out of my driveway, I said, Honey, are you all right? She said, It's gone. Yeah. She said, It's gone.
cheerleader and tell you what he's saying. That's right. No, 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 no. I'm talking about out of the belly. Yeah. Out of the belly. Yeah. Out of the belly. Yeah. I shall flow a river. Amen. But I said, Lord, show me. Amen. Then open up my mouth. And I read about that first deportation out of the land of Babylon. And Nebuchadnezzar chose out some young men. Amen. That was wives yeah. and some young men that he may come, a brother, and bring them to Babylon and teach them the language of the Chaldeans. Yeah. Amen. And show them everything. Oh, yeah. You know who that I'm preaching about. Amen. Oh, Daniel. Yeah. And the Bible said, Amen, that they couldn't find that God had through. Our brother, his interpretation of dreams, and yeah. God had promoted him very high yeah. in the land of Babylon. Yeah. And the Bible said that some of the men I was jealous. Yeah. And brother, any time you praise God, amen, there's going to be somebody jealous. Yeah. I hate to say it, but yeah. yeah. that yeah. some people don't like to see you get mad. Yeah. Yeah. Some people not. I don't want to see the anointing of God. Amen. Yeah. Yeah.
Yeah. I'm going to give God thanks. Yeah. Yeah. I wish somebody had told me this years ago. Yeah. Hey man, because when the storms of life are raging and you know what to do, don't hang your head like you're on the road. Oh. Oh. Don't hang your head like you're on the road. But Jesus found me and said, why are you so sad? Why is your countenance like this? Yeah. Hey man, we thought he was the one that's a redeemer. We yeah. thought he was alive. I'm going to tell you, he is alive. That's right. I think they're listening to me. Yeah. 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 Hold on just a minute. I think they're listening to me. Yeah. Oh, God, we thank you that Isaiah, the great prophet, yeah. told us, God, that we would come down, yeah. amen, into this land and be seed 70 years. But, God, we thank you today that we know that Isaiah prophesied about a day. Yeah. Amen. That King Cyrus would be a shepherd unto us yeah. and bring us out of this great, great land. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. God. I'm not preaching nothing, brother, that's made up. No. This thing right. is things real tonight. Amen. It's real and awesome. Amen. Listen, Amen. Brother Jason, I don't get what you're doing. Well, I pray tonight, the next time you're knocked off your feet, the next time you find yourself in the well's belly, hey, amen, you may be going down the road. You may be here. You may be there. Yeah. I pray this message will come back to you. Yes, sir. You're dragging your head down. Yes, I pray you raise your hand yes, up and say, God, I'm with this. He said, you got to get him out of there, King. He's done our praying and the decree said we got to kill him. Throw him in the den of lions. Paul said, amen, I fought with beast. He didn't fight with little beast. He fought with beast like spirits. Yeah. You know I mean? yeah. 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 Took in vows that they wouldn't even eat yeah. until they killed him out of God. Yeah. Yeah. He okay. said, I was delivered out of the line, yeah. right out of his mouth. Yeah. Yeah. He never fought a lion like Samson. No, no, no. I never read that, but he no. was fighting lion like me. Yeah. Yeah. Am I right tonight? Yeah. 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 Amen. Oh, don't you love the word of God? Yes, sir. Amen. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. Oh, Lord, it's the best medicine in this world. Yes. Oh, bless his name. Yes. 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 I don't know if you thanked him for it. I seen you last night, Clifford, yes. when you was up here. It touched me. Yes. Had that Bible down here in front of his face before he got up, he went. Yes. 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 They took him out. Amen. Of his prayer chambers. Yes. You know where they put him. They put him in that lion's den. Yeah. Yeah. But the lions had lost their taste yeah. for a man. Yeah. That was like yeah. The lions had lost their taste. Yeah. For a man that said, Bless the Lord, yeah. oh my soul. Yeah. And oh, that's the thing. Yeah. Well, David said, Wait a minute, boys. He said, I'm going to rise at midnight. And then he said, no, 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 that ain't no good. He said, seven times a day. He said, I'm going to give God the praise. I'm going to give God the honor. He said, no, that ain't no good. He said, let's just do it like this. From the rising of the sun. Be careful, I don't want to offend nobody. Then no, nobody likes singing. Bless you, brother. Come on. Being blessed like I do. Bless you, Jesus. Elijah couldn't get a hold of Elisha couldn't get a hold of God. I said, bring the minstrel. They brought the minstrel to play. Yeah. The Spirit of the Lord came on. We know that there's something that carries. When I go to my prayer place and pray, I'll take me a song with me. Yeah. I'll play that song. Bless you, man. And if I really get a hold of the Lord, the song will get done and I'll have to push for the play again. Yeah. 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 And when it's really yeah. working. Y'all yeah. know what I'm talking about? Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. I mean, when, when that song gets done, I'll push play. Hallelujah. 
and then I'll push it again. Yeah. And then I'll push it again. Yeah. Then when that thing gets done again, I said, I don't need you no more. Yeah. I'm not done yet. Right. You have issued me. Yeah. Right into his presence. Come on. Come on. But tonight we ain't gonna have no saint. Come on, Come on, Tonight we're just gonna thank him. Thank you. Yeah. Hallelujah. Oh, I'm talking about things years ago he did. Yeah. I'm talking about amen things that he's done that no one else knows about. Put groceries on your table. Put your tail bill on your stuff. Which they are bossing. You don't know how they knew. Now they was. Amen. There I was. Hallelujah. It's ain't for man. This ain't for show sure to oh, However you want to do it. If you say, put your I don't. Amen. Francis, I don't want nobody to see me. I'm just not that poor. I understand. Everybody ain't a sport. Everybody ain't a Tommy Dye. Everybody ain't a Leo the Wayne Perkins. If you make sure some way. Amen. Can we give him thanks? For 60 cents. Yes, sir. 60 seconds. Yes. Will you get tired in 60 seconds? Will you get weary? You talking about making me vomit. You talking about getting you out of the line. That's right. That old king come back there that night, fasted all night, got up the next morning, went down there and said, Hey, dang, are you alive? Hey, dang, has the God that you serve delivered you? Brother, out of the mouth of that dinner line. Bless 